Hi, viewers. You know what? We're gonna go that way because last time I hit a dead end by choosing the wrong path, so we can only go that way, which is to the left. To the left. To the left. Hmm. God help me. We're gonna get out of this dark maze of, of forestry and stuff, and when we get to the end, we're gonna fight a dragon! Freaking dragon with a spear, and look how menacing he looks. He's pissed off. Oh, I'm pissed off. You know what? Gildum ain't no. Gildum ain't no chub. He's gonna freaking thump a dragon! And I will thump that dragon. You know what? You ain't. You ain't nothing, Mr. Dragon. Oh, oh, look at you. I got fireball. Roar, I'm a big, scary dragon. Look at my lance. I'm using it as a toothpick. I'm a big, scary dragon. You know what? You ain't nothing, Mr. Dragon. I'm gonna just... corrode you. I'm gonna... You think you got stuff on me? It's I'm freaking killed him, the warrior. I'm a boy that's six, seven years old, and I got my dog bacon. Oh, you want to use fireball? I'll use fireball on you. Yeah, I'll show you how to use a real fireball spell. Then I'll sting you. Then I'll thump you. Was that it? Dragon was a chump. Dragon was a chump. And we win. Freaking Gildum is better than a dragon. And we get a lance. <laughs> Gildum is the man. Gildum is a warrior. Although he's still a kid. I learned that one from Michelangelo. Well, okay. Actually, you know what? I didn't learn it. I dedicate that battle to Michelangelo. Freaking love that Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. I digress. So, we got Lance. Still can't break down freaking rubble. Stupid. But I have a feeling we're going to be able to pretty soon, because... As you know, there's only one more weapon that we are missing right now, and you know it's got to come sooner rather than later, because these weapons, they always come in three, and God help me, they're all warrior-based. got the spear, we got an axe, we got... Ugh, not burping, we got freaking a sword. Sword... Is all right. We got a sheath to make it stronger. We got a spear. We got the ability to not chuck this at guys. <sighs> As you can imagine, that's going to be annoying. Trade in one spear for another one. It's not leveled. In fact, the only thing I can do is just stab people with it at short range. It's not that cool, guys. It's not that cool. As much as freaking Temper Drake was easy, his his real challenge is the fact that he gave me a weapon that starts off at level one. <laughs> I hate you, Timber Drake. Your vengeance knows no bounds. It's okay. I hear that there's another boss coming up that's actually much, much harder. I hear this is coming up. I don't actually know, to be quite honest. It could be a lie. It could be quite truthful. I've just heard these things. I have actually never done it. I've never been in this game. This is actually... I'm doing this blind, to be honest. Yeah, I, I, I have no clue where I'm going. This is like an empty sewer. It mimics freaking Ivor Tower, you know, with the sewer, except that I had freaking icky water, water slides, which pushed me everywhere. You know what this has? It has dried up sewer, which, I don't know, I guess it's better. You know what? I have a feeling I may have missed an alchemy spell, so, yeah, I gotta cut it real quick. Okay, turns out I am perfectly alright. There is no alchemy spells to find within this sewer. But I'll tell you what there is. There's a prison. Why is there a prison? What could be a lot of friggin' raptors? Raptors? They're alive? Who keeps them in the prison? Who keeps them well fed? Okay, I don't know. Oh, that's right, there's still people here, but what could possibly be here that's, like, I don't know, feeding these prisoners? Why are there prisoners? From the sounds of it, well, that's locked. That's stupid. From the sounds of it, you know, like, freaking, freaking, why are there prisoners in an almost empty town? Why are... Black raptors, I hate you. I'm gonna sting you, freaking raptor.
Dark Raptor, Shadow Raptor. Raptor, Raptor, Raptor. Wait, did Bacon just do 700? Bacon, did you just annihilate that Raptor doing almost max damage? I mean, I know they're stronger, but still, that was just like overkill, the best type of kill. And those look like wood mites. I don't even know if they are, but God, only they're gonna die either way. <laughs> they died easier than freaking everything else. Oh man, the last dungeon had much better stuff. Um, I guess there's still guard bot. That's kind of weird. I mean, psh, whatever, man. You know, futuristic. Why is it? Why is it trapped in a prison, which is pretty much abandoned? What was the queen thinking when she moved everything? Why are there prisoners? Did she lock them up? Who's been keeping them alive? I'm not gonna lie, the music sounds a lot more cheerful than freaking Ivor Tower, but... I don't know. It, it's much more desolate. Personally, I think I would have swapped music tracks, you know, have this play at Ivor Tower, so it really is the happiest place in Evermore. And I have, like, Ivor Tower's theme here, so it's very somber and kind of, I don't know, really has that extra oomph of desolation. Because I'm not seeing any stragglers. I'm not seeing anyone left behind. You know what I see? I see barrels bordering up houses and boxes, which I can only assume contains, like, spoiled food and stuff. But we can enter this house. Looks like there's fresh food. That's interesting. What happens if we go here? There's there's a guy. What's up? <laughs> what have we here? Yeah, I you know. You're not from Evan Keep or Ivor Tower. That's right, we're not. We're from Podunk. USA, baby. Oh. That's a shame. You should you should totally know of Podunk. It's awesome. Cecil of Baron Castle? Wait a second. Don't tell me. Cecil of Baron Castle. Oh my god. Have you heard of my- Oh my god, it really is! Freaking Final Fantasy IV season! Oh my god! Ah! Oh my god, it really is! I totally know about you! I love Final Fantasy IV! It's one of the best games ever! It's one of the good Final Fantasy games! All this armor yours? I'm in the presence of a legend! Yes, this is my business. Alright, I love your business! Even more so, this is more in canon with than the years after, even though everyone's like, I don't... Actually, to be honest, I don't really know that much about the years after, but... This came first, so it's in canon. That's how I see it. You might be like, No, it's not, Gildum. This is Evermore. It's a made-up world. You know what? I don't care. Someone had to imagine Cecil here. Someone had to play it. This came before 1995. Yeah. Besides, he feels like we're old friends, and he sells shining armor, and dragon's claws, and knight's helm. Which is even better armor, and we're totally gonna buy it. We're totally going to buy it. All of it. I appreciate your business. Well, I appreciate your services. You are awesome, man. I love your conquest from going from a dark knight, and oh my god, you just gave me a bazooka, dude! Not only are you an awesome cameo, you are an awesome NPC. I love what you've done for me. Shining armor, dragon's <laughs> knight's helm, dragon's claw. Went from a shadow knight to or dark knight to um holy paladin. That was awesome. I really like Final Fantasy IV. I like Cecil. He was one of the better protagonists of the Final Fantasy series, but. Uh, I guess we should stop being a fanboy. We got a bazooka. Uh, it, it's pretty awesome, but we only got one shell for it. Yeah. Um. You know, I think I'm gonna end it off here. Next time, freaking Cecil Final Fantasy Four. Yeah.